Mandibular pectora are so common nowadays. We see them every day. So many patients have them and they make PAs so difficult. So a little trick to make sure they're a little more comfortable for your patient. Number one, always look and see that if they have them first. A lot of times patients know, but then they won't say anything or they don't even know. So you'll just, if we don't look first, we just go in and place, we could hit it and it could hurt. So our patient here has tiny little baby ones, but they still hurt like crazy if we accidentally nick them with the sensor. Number two, place the sensor on the tongue. That goes against everything you've been taught, but it works. I always have them relax their tongue to the floor of the mouth and that'll be a cushion against the tori. Place the sensor in the center of the mouth. Ideally, you want the sensor as close to your target teeth as possible, but if they have this extra bone, there's no way you're gonna be able to get it close. So relax your tongue, place it right in the center of the tongue, right in the center of the mouth, put pressure, and then have them go ahead and bite and close for me. Perfect, it's way more comfortable, it's not so jarring on the patient, and that's exactly where I want it to be.